Previously on Fire Emblem Three Houses, Hubert decided he was going to become a flying dragon dark mage that destroys everything in his path, and Edelgard is going to become a bulky armored mage just like her predecessor Arvis. He's her predecessor? You know what? I just decided that. We're going to roll with it. Anyways, welcome back everybody to episode 6 of my Fire Emblem Three Houses Let's Play. I hope you guys are enjoying the Let's Play so far. I am having an absolute blast with this game. We seem to be spending a lot of time in the monastery. We had a little skirmish in the last one, but this time we're back to seminars. So this is the first time I think we've been able to do seminars. So let's get right into it and see what it's all about. W where is Shamir? Uh, I know she's on the list of teachers somewhere. Okay, so we get to select to lead seminars. We'll instruct others in their areas of expertise. Higher skilled instructors grant more skill experience to those who attend. Please choose to attend a seminar based on how well the subject matches their skill goals. Those with high motivation are more likely to attend. Okay. So I've got... Interesting. Group tactics in Geralt's mercenary fighting style. I can do Edelgard, Bernadetta, or Petra. Ancient Fodland fighting style utilizing land skills. Ooh, a lot of people can attend Hahnemann's class. Maybe I should just go to this one. Reason and Bow. Hmm. Faith and so I think this is good. This one will be good, actually. We'll do. We'll go Manuela's class, because Linhart and Petra can both benefit, and so can Byleth. So let's do that. All right, so we leveled up our faith. And then no one really leveled anything else up. Okay, then. Motivation of attendees increased by 50. Cool. It's Mercedes' birthday. Would you like to buy flowers and sell? Sure, let's buy Mercedes some flowers. She's a doll. She deserves it. Even though we're not going to recruit her, but whatever. Okay, there's an event on Friday. I think this is probably story. Perfect timing, Professor. I've just received word from the knights. They've located. Cool. The okay, so we're diving right into the bandits. It, it looks they like. Have them cornered. They are in Red. The Red oh, Canyon. Red Canyon. We've heard of this one before. This was where the opening scene was talking about something about um, uh, what Saros had experienced. I can't wait to get started. I'll strike down those heinous thieves before they know what. <laughs> okay, there, Caspar. Hold on. Charge ahead if you must, Caspar. Just do not put the rest of us in danger. I'm going back. I won't be of any help anyway, and I don't want to get hurt. Don't worry, Burn. Burn. It's just some bandits. We'll have no trouble at all. Uh, someone isn't doesn't know what Burn actually is. Uh oh. Eh, don't get ahead of yourselves. Unfounded optimism isn't a great strategy. Let's just get this over with. There is nothing to get over. We will work with each other to achieve Oh, hey, look, good mission. English from Petra. You seem to get excited out there. I'm not sure about this. Nah, we're excited. Let's do it. It's time, Professor. Give us our orders and let's move out. I love how regal Edelgard looks. She looks great. Cool. I guess... Nice, two, two episodes back to back with some battling. So yeah, marketplace or mission? Do we need to buy anything for anyone? Let's take a look at inventories. This iron sword is fine. We've got a leather shield and a steel sword on him. Edelgard's got her iron axe. Getting a little bit low on the uses there. He's got a full lance. He's getting a little bit low on the iron lance. We should buy Linhart an iron sword, I would say. Caspar's fine. Bernie's fine. Dorothea also should get an iron sword because the training ones just don't do it once they run out. And we'll give we'll buy Petra a bow, actually, I want to say. Ooh, do we get a steel bow? Decisions, decisions. Nah, let's keep it to iron. And let's buy... Who did we say we were buying stuff for? Ferdinand should get another lance. 
Let's get him a Steel Lance. Okay, that's a lot of gold. I actually should hold off on how much Lances I buy. What secondary? I mean, Linhart's already got sword experience, so I'm kind of tempted to just get, go, make him go down the sword route as well. Okay, I think now we're good for weapons. Maybe we buy Edelgard another Iron Axe. Maybe. Oh, Hand Axe. I like the I like the idea. Or a Mace. What does Mace do? Weapon that can ravage armor. Effective against armored units. I don't think... Oh, that's what these things... Oh, they have the effect... Oh, what they're effective against. Okay, well, yeah. I should have been quicker on the pickup for that. Um... A hand Axe would be nice. It doesn't really do that much damage, though. It's kind of inaccurate. Uh, let's buy a Hand Axe. I think it'll be a good investment. And we should buy... Casper some gauntlets. There we go. Alright, now we're done shopping. I think we're good. Um, we can actually sell something. Who has the uh, the gold that we got last time? Oh, it's only a thousand, but that's fine. Oh, Dorothea didn't get a sword. Let's buy Dorothea's sword. We definitely want her to do magic and swords, right? Let's buy her a proper sword. She deserves a sword. Okay, now we're good. So I'm guessing you just can't buy magic. Magic is just something that you learn and you increase your uses of. Which is interesting that they're going down that road. Because that means it's limited. We haven't unlocked Blacksmith yet. Italian Guild, we haven't unlocked. Okay, cool. All right. Well, let's get into it. Um, menu. Gives us the option to save. Let's do that. Calendar brings us back here. Goals. Storehouse. A book containing the basic of tactics doesn't look like it's been read much. Okay, this is... Oh, these are just items that we've gotten along the way. Okay. Let's go on a mission. We already did the practice battle. Can't do that again, so we gotta... Gotta deploy for the Red Canyon dominance. No, gotta save again. All right, we'll save again. That's cool. Still simping, sipping on my orange mango lime juice over here. Some good stuff. If you guys haven't tried that, you definitely should. All right, Red Canyon Dominance, White Clouds, Chapter 2, Familiar Scenery. So I'm assuming this is the end of Chapter 2. So we are taking children into battle, are we? I'm not certain I will be able to sleep sound. Taking the children into battle, that. says the one who looks like a child herself. I shall allow you to turn back the hands of time. But no, this power is not... Interesting, so this looks like... Oh, this is the Divine Pulse, or the Mila's Turn Wheel function. So, ZL button during player phase to trigger Divine Pulse. At the end of each battle, Divine Pulse uses will be recharged. All right. So, let's take a quick look at items. So, she's got the axe. Does the magic show up on their inventory here anywhere i can't really see it oh skills here it is okay so he's got miasma delta i think that's what it is and meyer b so as they level up they get more magic they learn magic that's interesting all right so linhart has heal now or maybe he always did and i just didn't see that that's interesting these are classes Let's look at everyone's classes here. So Edelgard would have to go down. Can I can I look at classes? Yeah, here we go. So this monk and then how do these work? Like what goes into what? Or can you just promote from anything into anything else? I have no idea. But it looks like, yeah, certain units are limited to certain classes. Not everyone can do everything. Yeah, she's got a lot of intermediate classes. 
I think we'll make Petra a thief and then maybe an assassin. I don't know. She. I think I kind of like that route for her. No, we can't make him a dragon rider. Oh, that's so disappointing. That's, that's, yeah, I'm not gonna lie. That's disappointing. I should have, although that's my fault. I should have taken, I should have taken a look beforehand. Oh, no, never mind. We can. Yes. Although I wonder if mages can use magic in this class or if they lose it. Ah, uh, there's so much stuff I want to know about this game. But I'm just going to play it however I want to play it for now, and then we'll see during the class changes what happens. I think it would be sick to have, like, a dragon riding mage. All right, let's just, let's just, oh, wait, no, no, let's check supports first. Can anyone support anyone? No? No? That's weird. Okay, well, all right, let's get into it. Defeat enemy commander. So this is the Red Canyon, a ruin of sorts by the look of it. Let's yeah, I'm down. Quick. Let's end it quickly. The thieves must have been driven back. Be careful or the cornered must okay. bite us. Oh, it's Costas again. Oh, boy. Chief, let's get out of here. There's no way we can win against them. Shut your dumb mouth! Where would we go at this point? You can't be a thief if you fear death! Alright, so this looks uh, fairly straightforward. We've got a bridge. Professor, I hear there's a back oh, there is a back road to the west. Let's split, split up and attack from both. Attack from both the west and I'll think the about it. If we advance tactfully, we can attack our enemy from both sides. I leave the rest to you. Regardless, we must cross the bridge first. Oh, okay, so... So we can't, yeah, so this is flyers only. So we gotta cross here and then we can go and split up here and here. We got some mages for the first time. He, they can heal as well. They've got some archers. So yeah, we're not only seeing melee classes anymore. Now we've got a bunch of different, you know, a mix up of mages and archers. The map looks interesting. There's an initial area here. So, I mean, if we take these three out then it looks like there's waves of, of three. This guy looks different. He's got a brigade, it looks like, with him that he can use. Can't quite make... He's got the triangle, so that's what I'm assuming. All right, anyways, let's get started here. I will got, oh, the hand axe now lets us attack right away, but we're not going to do that. Uh... They kindfully gave us a thicket so that we can tank on it. So I, I guess we got to think about who we're going to tank with. Edelgard's the closest, so we're just going to wait, let her tank this out here while we bring up everyone else to come and help with the onslaught. You know, someone could tank next to her. I think we'll let Stay focused. Byleth do that with his iron sword. He's pretty tanky. He's pretty good. And Casper can there. come and walk up here. Bernadetta's just like hiding in the back doing nothing. As, you as wish. I wish, of course, as I wish. That's my cue. Uh, I'll bring Dorothea here. Linhart. Battle. I will Petra. Get the Good stuff. <laughs> so yeah, Arvis slash Byleth still doesn't double yet, but. I'm sure we'll figure it out eventually. Everyone's getting hit. Edelgard taking massive chunks out of people's HP. Oh. Um, I didn't notice he could walk that far away, and he's doubling Casper too, which is kind of concerning. Oh, I don't know. Maybe he's supposed to be slow. Wait, how far did he just shoot? He had he had a lot of range there. Oh, he has this, it looks like the range plus one ability. So he's got bow prowess two and yeah, bow range plus one. Okay, so that I'm thinking that's, um. it looks like it's a, a bow skill of sorts. 
All right, let's give Bernadetta a kill here. She's gonna have to use that combat art to do a little bit more damage. She still doesn't kill. Okay, we gotta think about who we're, who we're giving kills here to. So Casper can probably smash. Yep, perfect damage. Oh, did he get a crit there? No, that's just a normal smash animation. Cool. What a jump. All right, so he's level three now. No, oh, he got speed and resistance. Okay, so that's I'm a little bit patching started. up the weak points, I suppose. Are all real battles this exciting? Come on, let's get on to the next uh, one. Is that normal? Gambit. I mean, we don't even need a Gambit at this point. She just shreds people. She's pretty strong. I think it would be valuable to have her beat this guy up at close range, so then we can finish him off with a long-range person. She doesn't really need the experience, so we can feed it to someone else. Okay, so Meyer has... Oh, Meyer has a lot of range. Okay, that's interesting. That that opens up some, uh, some nice combos. All right, so Dorothea's pretty weak, but she's level two. Let's give Dorothea a kill. Why not? Uh, let's give her a kill from next to... Does Edelgard give the students bonus... Bonus XP? No, it's just for her. So to utilize the bonus XP, we kind of want to attack from near Byleth. But I uh, might have... Yeah, okay. Linhart, Linhart should get a kill here. Also no. Yeah, because Edelgard will one-shot, and we're kind of in a sticky situation here. Okay, let's, let's weaken with Hubert's Lance. And if he takes a hit, we'll just heal him with Linhart on the next turn. And then we'll attack with Linhart from here. Give Linhart the kill. Can't get yeah, he needs a level up, so that was that was worth. And the level up wasn't really worth though. Logic. He learned Physic. Okay, so Linhart wants to be a healer, it looks like. I, I killed them. Oh, interesting. I killed them. What is this blood? I guess the students are coming to a realization that they're, they're doing something that's not so, not so good after all. All right, Ferdinand, you know what? We'll take it for the sake of moving forward. The mark of nobility. These ruffians are no match oh, that's what they were saying, that they were going to start, you know, realizing slowly on the battlefield that it might not be for them. And then uh, Edelgard was like, do I look like a... What did she say? I forget. Oh, this is interesting. It really provides some depth and growth to the characters. I actually really appreciate that now. I also like that the enemies don't just wait for you like a sack of potatoes. They they actually come at you. And this guy's got a lot of range. He does seven times two to Edelgard. Yikes. And so does this guy. Wow. One, two, three, four. He's got five range. Yeah, so they can both attack Edelgard. So maybe we... Maybe we move Edelgard back a little bit. Might be a good idea, so... Still, Still Yeah, you are, you've are. you been pretty unstoppable lately, not gonna lie. And then let's assist and heal up Hubert here. Unexpected. 
Cool. And we can kind of choke point and turn. Oh, man, these guys double. They double anyone. I wonder if that's like a thief skill where they just, they two shot or they hit twice for everything. Oh, wow. We almost, we almost lost our, our main character. Uh, if I had miscalculated that a little bit. Okay. All right. Less of a joke than we thought. So I wonder... Be mindful. Steel Sword finishes this guy off. We should probably give our main character some experience. There we go. You fought well. Yeah, because he's falling a little bit behind, and I think he's going to be one of our, our major... All right, strength, speed, luck, and defense. That was Such a good level. That's solid. Uh, but I wonder, what, what are these guys' speed stats? 13? I guess maybe that's why they were doubling. Let's bring, bring Edelgard up here to kind of bash this guy in the face a little bit. How much does Dorothea do with Thunder? 13, okay, cool. So we can do Edelgard, Dorothea. And then maybe we can kill the other guy with a combination of different things. Okay, battalion leveled up. That's cool. Dorothea. Please hit. Nice. Okay, she's going to level up now, I think. I've got many Yay! Strength, please. Magic and charisma. My units are not getting great level ups, but I'm going to say that this is just because. Oh man, are we doubting the church's teachings here? This blasphemy, blasphemy. Okay, so now we can three man this guy As you wish. because we can use mire, do a lot of damage. How much does Ferdinand do? Linhart can do some damage. Petra can reach. A lot of people can reach. We should give Bernadetta a kill. How much damage can she do? Eight or nine. Okay, so we gotta do a total of 18 damage. So can Petra double and weaken this guy? She cannot. How much does Meyer do? 12, okay, let's just pray that this hits. Okay, good. What was the effect? All right, I missed the effect on that. I don't know what it is. We can weaken with Ferdinand, I think. No, Ferdinand kills straight up, okay. Oh, they okay, so that debuffs his defense or something. Cool, so we don't even need to use the combat art to kill him with Bernie. Man, Bernadetta gets her first kill on the battlefield. Almost levels up. Almost. I don't care if they're stealing yeah, yeah, sure, whatever. Uh, we need to heal Mr. Main Character, so we will have Linhart do that. Well Alright, so we've uh, faced two waves of these enemies so far. Casper and... Petra haven't really done much. All right, now the next wave is starting to move towards us. I wonder if this is a hard mode only thing. I haven't really seen any of the normal mode playthroughs, so someone who's playing in normal mode, let me know. All right, let's see if we can go on the offensive here. Let's start really moving everyone up. Stay focused. Just gotta move everyone quickly. I wonder if we can probably take off, you know, half the wave that's coming up. Just if we if we be proactive. A lot of people when they play Fire Emblem like to sit back and wait. Uh, I used to do that a lot before, but now I've learned that you can kind of be a little less fearful of the enemies and what they're doing. Oh, there's a chest over there. So I wonder if we let them steal it and then we take it from them. 
Does this guy have like a chest key that he's... Oh, he has a chest key that he's dropping. Okay, so we are rewarded. How are these guys even going to get in? Oh, they have to go around. Okay, so we take the chest key from this guy. We open the chest. And these guys also have chest keys or they can just pick locks? Yeah, allows unit to open doors and chests without keys. Okay. So we're going to do that. But... These guys have such large movement. My god. And they all double, too, which is really annoying. And this guy would also be in range. I don't know if I can tank three of them. The only one who'd be able to do so is maybe Petra. So, despite what I was saying earlier, I might wait a little bit here. Just to tank these guys a little bit. How far does this guy go? This guy doesn't move as far. These guys have a lot of movement. Thieves have a lot of movement. Okay. We can lure this guy in down here, down the bottom with Byleth. So, so let's do that. Let's do the two birds with one stone approach. They're going to come down. So we bring Dorothea down here. Just kind of also move to the side while we lure some people in so we're kind of just shifting around our movements a little bit and then now we're kind of broken into two teams still but we're baiting two different sides of the map so let's see let's see what we can do here all right so he's only attacking petra once she's pretty fast so oh come on really we're gonna miss the 86 like that well that kind of sucks and that guy's on the thicket now which is going to be a problem we stole this treasure it's all ours there's no way we're gonna give it up to so is this guy kind of like a mini boss i suppose oh it's because he's got the battalion oh i forgot about that so interesting when someone uses a battalion against you you can't hit back that might have been a mistake on my end to use the battalions there yeah now we're a little bit overwhelmed here well, let's see what we can do. Yeah, we can't really move because of the way this guy used the battalion on us. At least I can't move Byleth or Hubert, so that's a little bit of a loss for us here. We need to take down these, well, at least one of these two thieves. I wonder though if Petra can just destroy this guy. No, she can't kill him, okay. <sighs> okay, let's let's figure this out. So Edelgard can use this battalion here to our advantage and it hits the other guy over as well. So let's do that. Shall I help? Oh, there's a gambit. We won't hold back. Oh, the gambit boost. That's what made it stronger. Okay, I see. So now these guys can't move either, I think. And this guy's this guy's almost dead, so we just, anyone can finish him off. If Casper uses Smash, he probably kills this guy. Perfect, so that's exact damage. No one makes Good pass stuff, me. Casper. Alright, so Crisis somewhat averted. And we can actually give Bernie a kill here. Another one to get her a little bit more experience. Do we go for the 67 or do we... Ah, let's risk the 67. We're in a good spot. Yeah, there we go. Bernie's getting the level. Deck speed, defense resistance. Solid level up. Okay, so now let's take care of this guy. go 13 here no I want to get the kill with Dorothea because Hubert's already decently leveled up so we can get the kill with Dorothea why not really that's just gonna screw up everything well, I guess we go kill this mage now how much damage does Linhart do to him? Three. No, 
not a good idea. Also not a great idea. Damn. Okay, so Linhart needs to heal Casper. Who's this guy targeting? Petra. Alright, so we'll get Petra on the thicket then. Does he change? No, he's still targeting Petra. Okay, Ferdinand. Can move here. Now this guy's targeting Hubert, which is fine. Oh, we can still kill this guy, actually. Let's use this gambit here, Wrath Strike, or the uh, combat art. And then Dorothea can, can go for the finish. Okay, I, I missed that part of it. Actually, Dorothea going for the finish here would be pretty good because we'll get the experience boost. So that, that worked out, actually. The What? Are you serious? Every time I think it's gonna work out, something goes wrong. Like that's a 91 miss. Let's think carefully. Oh my goodness! You better dodge this. Okay, good. Man. All right, this game is starting to get me riled up now. We're only we're only on like the second chapter, and we're starting to get the 91 misses. All right, can we get the kill here, please? It's 85, it's less chance than the last time, but it should be good enough and I want the experience, so. Yeah, winning is always nice. Thank you for winning this time and not losing like the last time. Yeah, okay, we know how to unlock chests, that's not. There's another guy with a gambit over here, so we're gonna have to think, maybe we bait him in with Edelgard once we finish. Uh, we've got another wave coming, maybe we wait. I don't know. Okay, what are we doing with this guy? Let's let's try and decide what we're doing with this guy. We will bring teacher in, and then we will finish from the left hand side to stack the XP. That'll guard could probably take a big whack at him. Yeah, there's a good chunk gone from his his health. Let's do that. That'll guard's kind of acting like our Jagan here, or she just kind of bops people for others to finish off. Can Bernadetta? No. Casper, Edelgard, Ferdinand. Let's do Ferdinand. There we go. Steel Lance coming in handy. You should be on it. All right, luck and I'm assuming that's charisma. I should really learn what those actually mean. Let's see. Charm. I've been saying charisma the entire time. I mean, it's kind of the same thing. Charm, what does it do? Raises gambits, might hit rate and avoidance. Okay. Oh, that's pretty useful. Okay, does anyone need to be healed? I think Petra needs to be healed. Let's do that. Oh, nice. Okay, the crest worked out, so... Good stuff. Okay, Hubert. Let's try and, and prep for next turn here. Line everyone up and get them ready to go all out. Oh, I didn't know. I, I keep misjudging the range of the archers. Well, that's fine, I guess. And these guys are axe users, so they're slower anyways, so we'll be fine. And Petra can just manhandle this guy with her iron sword, so we'll do that. And then maybe Bernie can get another another finish off. Who knows? That'll be good for her helps her catch up a little bit. Casper's level three. Is there anyone else level two? Bernadetta. 
Linhart's level two, but we can't really reach anyone there. So yeah, we'll get we'll give it to Bernadetta. Yeah, she's hitting this guy pretty hard, so go for it. Am I done yet? Can any ranged units reach out that far? No. So uh eleven ten. Yeah, I really do not want Petra to die. That would be less than ideal. Thank you. Right, well, we're out of heals now, so... Who are they targeting? This guy's targeting Casper, and this guy's targeting... Doubles Byleth. This guy's targeting Linhart and doubles Linhart. That's not good. Why are these guys so fast? Maybe we let him do that to be honest. And let's bait this guy out over here with Ferdinand. And we can wait it out, bring Dorothea up, and Hubert can kind of hang around here to help. I think we'll survive the turn. I don't think this should be too big of an issue. Oh, right, then heart heals. Okay, I, I was a little bit scared there, a little bit concerned for a minute, but... I think that should be okay. And this guy's going after Byleth, which is totally fine. Oh, I think they might double because he's got the Steel Sword equipped. It might be weighing me down. I really should learn all the equations on how these work. I've kind of just been enjoying the game, playing it at my own pace, just doing whatever I want. Oh, this guy didn't go for a Gambit. That's interesting, and he missed, so... Well done, Ferdinand, well done. Okay. Let's think about how we're going to make use of Byleth's XP gain thing here. So, yep, Petra can win this one, and she can get some XP. Cool. That exact damage. I think that was exact damage. Oh, she leveled up her sword. Does she get an art? Grounder. One step before the next step. All right. People and beasts are as one. Calm your heart. Wow, that's do not be worried about this savage. <laughs> that's pretty savage. I'm not gonna lie. Man, Bernadetta doing damage. That's some thick damage. I'm impressed. She can get some more XP. I think she levels up here. Anywhere I can hide. Nice, more Dex, Speed, and Res. Bow's leveled up too. Bow prowess level two. Damn, hey, yeah, Bernadetta. Look at you. Okay, so Dorothea's got the key. So we'll let her do some chip damage. She won't be able to get this kill, but we'll put her in position for next turn to open the chest. And I don't know if I really want to split the team up in two. Like, it's not really necessary at this point. We can all just go west at this point. It might just be quicker if everyone just moves this way. I don't know. Because, like, everyone here just left the area, so... Except this guy. This guy's weird. Just leave him alone. I don't really care about him. Alright, who are we killing this guy with? Let's move Violet here. And maybe we let Ferdinand get that finishing blow, because he dodged it before, so he tanked it. So he deserves a finishing blow. Let's give it to him. This was beneath, beneath you? All right. Okay. Everyone else is going to move west, I decided. We're all going this way. Although I'm kind of tempted to just send a couple up. Nah, we're all going this way. I'd like to take it easy. You'd like to take it easy? Okay, take it easy then. Okay, so these guys are moving down. Dumb archers. We should keep... Uh, keep yeah, so, wow, look at that range. 
far is that? One, two, three, four. All right, so we're out of range if we wait here, which is fine. She can come open the chest since she has the key. What are we getting? Oh, money. Money's always nice to get. Move Linhart because he's our main healer. It's nice that he heals three every turn where he just doesn't do anything. I guess that's because he's lazy. All right, let's see what we got. This guy's just walking down. I'm making my way downtown. Iron Lance, Steel Lance would do a lot more. Can anyone even finish him off? Ow. Yikes! Okay, that's not good. Um, I mean, Ferdinand will be able to tank him, so I'm not too concerned. Six damage if he attacks with 75%. Do I want to risk that? I don't really know if I do. Ooh, he can hit back on Hubert, too. This guy's nasty. All right, let's poke him with an Iron Lance. This guy's gonna move back and cause us a lot of trouble. He's gonna hit from here and just be obnoxious. We need to block off that side and we need to heal. Um... Oh, we're using physic uses now. Okay. All right, well. Oh, you gotta level up from healing, that's good. Speed and defense. I mean, that'll come in handy, I suppose. Stay focused. Okay, so we've we've blocked off most of the area. But yeah, that archer's dangerous. All right, yeah, let's see what he's gonna do. He's probably gonna move on to the thicket and attack us because he's not stupid. And yeah, now the rest of them are coming down. Oh, he didn't move on to the thicket. All right, that's fine. Ferdinand's, Ferdinand's holding up. He's He's holding down the fort. He's doing pretty well. All right, let's 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 get another chip in with Ferdinand here. Good, okay, now someone can come finish off this archer. This guy's, this guy's been pretty annoying. I don't know if anyone can, I don't know, Petra can use a bow and reach. Should we give that a shot? Let's give that a shot. Let's see why not. Yeah, there we go, that's good. One more Level four, baby. Speed, luck, and charm. Battalion leveled up as well. Increase hit. Nice. Good stuff. Um, yeah. How far can this guy attack? All right, so let's bring everyone down the west side. West side. Linhart getting a little bit more HP recovery there. Everyone a little bit choke pointed onto this bridge, but we're we're getting there. We're almost we're almost out. Maybe we should have gone up. That would have been maybe a little bit quicker. Yeah, Petra can't fire back just yet, so. Yeah, time for all the melee units to just be savage. We haven't used gauntlets yet. Interesting he can double with them. Okay. So let's, let's go around behind him and attack with Ferdinand. Ferdinand's really been doing a good job just chipping away at people slowly. I'm, I'm starting to like him. He's doing what Hubert was kind of doing in the last chapter. Yeah, let's not do that. Unless Casper weakens him for... Linhart to take the final blow. Let's let's try that. Iron Axe. 
Hey, you level up his axe. As long as it makes me. We'll wait with Violet so Linhart can get the XP. Yeah, 95. I, I'm feeling a little bit confident about the 95. I'll take that. Huh. Victory. Alright, and now we can start moving Caution in. Is needed. Moving in closer and closer to the boss. We've got like two enemies to go. Should be no problem. We'll take care of this mage easily. Easily. Yeah, so this was an, I guess, an interesting chapter. In the, I, I liked more so the um, the way the units were talking about killing other people and like the deaths. To me, that was really interesting because we've never really seen anyone react like that in Fire Emblem before. So yeah, it was definitely something new that we've not experienced before. Yeah, let's have Ferdinand do a little bit chip and level up. Yeah. Well, he was supposed to level up there, but I guess he's not. And now he's kind of in an annoying position. How far can this guy move? Who are we giving the finishing blow to? Because Byleth's here, so we should probably give it to a melee. Honestly. Uh, let's, let's keep leveling up her sword level for now. Everyone's taking pretty heavy damage. Casper. Let's give it to Casper. Unless he misses. Okay, thank God. Alright, now we're in the clear. There's a couple enemies left. Casper's level 4. Really making use of that um, magic speed, luck, charm. Lucky charm! Alright, let's move up. Let's assist physic. On Petra, she needs some healing. We'll give her the physics. I, thank you. I guess since magic runs out and just replenishes itself at the end of every chapter, we should probably just spam magic as much as possible. It's combat arts that really have uses and they don't end. So in that regard, I think spamming magic is probably a safe bet. I will get and we'll the let Petra bait this guy, I guess. Because she doesn't get doubled, so she should be okay. Yeah, she'll be okay. And Linhart, I'll let Linhart heal her again. Just for the heck of it. And he can get his XP as well. And then everyone else can... Yeah, Ferdinand, Ferdinand, you've, you've, done, you've done what you needed to do. I'm proud of you, buddy. I think Ferdinand, I hope he's he gets the MVP this battle although i feel like yeah this one this one's gonna be a little bit interesting to see who gets the mvp if you're still watching comment below who th you think the mvp is and then you'll see at the end if you're right petra just kind of slaps him back no you take it back All right, does Kostas move? No, he doesn't move. He's just a stationary boss. That's kind of boring. Does he have a hand axe at least? No, so you could technically just chip away at him in theory. That's, yeah, I don't I don't know if I like that. All right, let's get Hubert. Let's look at Meyer. Let's see how Meyer looks like. Yuck. Ew. Blech. Meyer. All right, who is getting the kill? Do we give it to, let's give it to Dorothea. And she's out of weapons, of course she is. Um, all right, we can move Petra up. And then Dorothea can come and slap him with a sword. 
should do enough damage, even with the training sword. Hey, we got a little four Dorothea as well. Let's see what she gets. Magic speed charm. I'll take it. More speed is always good. More doubles are always good. All right, now everyone can move up. Linhart just casually healing slowly. Yeah, Ferdinand, Ferdinand needs to chill. We might have to dispatch that one last archer before we can uh, finish off the boss, the chapter. I mean, that might not be a bad idea. Wasting XP is never a good idea, especially when you're playing on hard mode. Eh, let's, let's move up and away from him for now. Ferdinand can move out. Casper might be able to do the finishing blow to the archer. We'll bait him onto this tile here, I think. Either this one or this one. We'll leave Edelgard in range because she's she can tank it. She hasn't really had much to do this chapter. I guess Dorothea can stay here and avail of whatever she needs to avail of next turn. And we can just stop here. Let's see who he attacks. He'll probably go after Byleth. I have an inkling he probably doubles. Or, oh no, he went after Petra. Okay. She's almost leveled up her class point thing. Oh yeah, there we go. There it is. Maxed. Mastered skills for commoner. Ability plus five. My understanding has completion. So does that mean we need to reclass her now? Is that how it works? I need to really look into how the... The reclass leveling up system thing kind of works. Okay, so who's still level three that we need to... Our main character needs some love. He should get a... Maybe... We... You know what? I'm going to let him kill the boss. So we'll let someone else have this one. Casper's level four. Bernadetta, Dorothea. Ferdinand's still three after all he did this chapter. Linhart, Hubert, Hubert's, okay, Hubert, my boy Hubert's got to get a kill, man. Nah, we're, we're, we're going to give Hubert a kill for sure. All right, let's weaken him with MC. Yeah, Hubert's got to get a kill. It's, it's, it's blasphemy if Hubert ends a chapter without getting a kill. Okay, so our main character also maxed out commoner. That's interesting. No, let's just do Miasma Delta. That has better hit rate, and we've got extra. Yeah, Hubert hasn't had much to do either. He is—he usually breaks his tomes, so. There we go, my boy Hubert getting that level four. Lucky, nah, you gotta do better, man. You gotta do better than that. Come on. Yeah, this is his first kill this chapter. Wow. Okay. Um, Petra? Yikes! What's this guy's speed? 13 speed. 13 speed. I guess maybe that's why he doesn't move. So that we chip away with him from a distance with magic. It's a good thing I didn't use up all my magic yet, so... Let's figure out how we're gonna do this next turn. We might have to hit him with Mire, actually. That might be a good idea. Yeah, let's hit him with Mire. Sending these brats instead of the knights means they've underestimated. Mire. All right, so now he's weakened. Still does 15 times two. That's a Edelgard can one-shot him. I know I said we were going to give the kill to the main character, though. Okay, so one more chip. I have Bernadetta do a little bit of chip damage for us here. And then we'll get that finish with our boy, Arvis. You're... It can't be. The mercenary from before? So what? Now I'm pals with the knights. Let's get let's get it. Uh, I should have never 
listen to that idiot. What a mistake. Oh yeah, we, we definitely got that level up there. Arvis needs it. He, he's kind of... Oh, damn! What a level up. Okay, there we go. Now we're talking. Arvis, Arvis, getting OP. Thank you for leading us, Professor. Though I suppose there was no way we could lose... Okay, wow, this episode's reaching up to an hour. Well, I guess, I mean, nothing I can do about that. We'll just upload it in full, because it wouldn't make sense to do less. <laughs> Bernadetta, the MVP! Now, that's something I didn't see coming, although I suppose she did get a bunch of kills and leveled up, so... Okay! All right, so we're going to end that here. Uh, thank you, everybody, for watching episode six of my Fire Emblem Three Houses Let's Play, and I will see you in the next one. Stay tuned. Peace.